Ooh. Look at that. All right, where's our explosives? Let's give them a, a triple. Oh, Lordy. Welcome back, everybody, to Seven Days of Dime, an old guy gaming. And in this episode, we are going to go hit some more questing and see if we can get ourselves to tier five. We have two main goals left in this series before I switch to Undead Legacy. And that is to hit tier five and do a tier five um, in Alpha 20, which we haven't done yet. <clears throat> and finish the exterior part of the house. Uh, but we've been doing a couple of building-based episodes, so let's go get some action uh, going on in this episode. We will do at least uh, one more Horde Night in this series as well, um, which is coming up in a few days. So, yeah, I'll meet you guys over at the quest location. All right, here we are. Where exactly are we, though? <laughs> what is this place? Um, military bunker? I don't remember when we took the quest what it said it was. Oh, this this is the big shotgun messiah place. Okay, cool. Say good night, Arlene. Yeah, cool. Okay, I've never been in here, actually, you guys. Not this new one, anyway. How to be fun. All right, let's go. Let's check it out. This is a fetch and a clear. All right, decent amount of concrete and stuff in here. I don't think this door is going to open up. Nope. Let's see what's in here. Some wood. I'll take it. Yeah, we don't really need gasoline. We're doing pretty good on that. Any zombies up above? We can get a sneaky sneak off on. Don't see any. We might get rushed out some of these doors. There's a safe in there. Nice. Right. Let's check. <clears throat> There's a shoddy messiah crate up there. Let's check this toolbox. All right, we'll take lock picks. Always welcome lock picks. I guess we're gonna probably have to nerd pull up there, or do some parkour to get to that. I can't get up any higher than this. Um, it won't, yeah, it won't let me get on there because, <clears throat> there we go. Because it was only a one block space. All right, what you got? Nice. Uh, shotgun slugs, okay. We'll take that. And then are we supposed to drop down inside of here? I don't see any monsters in here. that door open? Nope. We'll have to break it. We will have to break it. Here's a bookshelf with a semi-mod. Nice. Semi-automatic mod, that is. We'll check this and scrap that. Nothing else there. All right. Let's see what's in the bookcase. I said bookcase. I meant safe. <laughs> Another machete and an ergonomic... Grip mod. Is there something we could put that on? Don't have any enough room on that. Um, we don't have. Well, that's already got one. That's got one. Uh, I guess we could put it on the shovel, even though I don't really expend a lot of stamina on the shovel. Oh yeah, let's put it on this. I think. Wait. Hold on a second. Forgot to loot it. 
I'm uh, I've been playing a lot of Icarus lately, and so my muscle memory is completely tuned into Icarus, and I'm having some problems doing seven days to die muscle memory. Okay, so I guess we bust this door down here. Got some friends outside. Hi, buddy. Bye, buddy. Over here, dummy. Oh. Oh. I'm right here, Arlene. Right here. I'm having, <coughs> excuse me, I'm having some, um, some freezes. Um, I do have some good news, too. I, uh, well, it's not good news for my bank account. <laughs> I, uh, uh, bit the bullet and bought a new graphics card. I got a 3060 Ti installed. Um, I kind of, I did it because, primarily because Icarus, uh, my 1080 was just having a hard time on Icarus. It ran it okay when I just played, but when I was playing and recording, which I do all the time, uh, it just wasn't, the performance wasn't up to par, so. I got a new graphics card, but man, I'm noticing, still noticing the freezes. Um, I, I've had that problem before, too, in, in this city, because there's just so much stuff here. Um, so, I don't know. Um, in fact, hold on a second. Before we proceed, what are my, I haven't even looked at my graphics settings in a long time. Um, we have custom quality. So, I mean, this graphics card should be able to handle anything seven days to die can throw at it. Even if we, you know, if we put everything on, on ultra. So, I don't think the issue, whatever it is. Oh, no, we don't want motion blur on. Does anybody in the, in the entire planet, on the entire planet, like motion blur? I hate it. Can't stand it. Um... Depth of field, I'm not a huge fan of that. Sometimes it's okay, but let's turn that off. Uh, everything else, like I said, this graphics card should, shouldn't should bat an eyebrow with ultra settings on this game. So if there are performance issues, uh, it's just game optimization. It's not my graphics card. It's not my graphics card, man. Don't you dare blame it on my graphics card, especially with as much money as I paid for the damn thing. Okay. Anyway, um... Yeah, it, it does seem to be a little stuttery in here, though, now, doesn't it? Uh, but again, I doubt that's the card. Let's let's set everything to high. Uh, but, again, turn motion blur off and depth of field off. Let's try that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't notice a huge difference one way or the other, to be honest with you, but... Let's just keep trucking here. I don't know that there's going to be anything super fantastic in these bookshelves. Um, I guess we can take that stuff because it's useful. And then we have a gun rack. Nice. Magnum. I'll take that. Some shoddy shells. Some crappy high-end high armor. Some nice high-end armor. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. We're going to have to compare the stats on that. That's nice, too. Okay. <coughs> what are we currently wearing for arms? We're on iron, which is, and it's a completely broken iron, too. So we needed that upgrade. Uh, let's take the stuff off of here. And modify this. Okay, yeah, that was that was an upgrade worth the price of admission for sure. Um, and then this I'm going to fix up and sell later. Now, let's compare crossbows. I'm going to take all of this off. I know... Whoops. No, don't do that, Windows. I know I don't have to, but those numbers always confuse me. No, Windows, go away. I accidentally started up some stupid Windows card game. Okay. So, this one is actually not as good. Fun pimps, would you guys knock that shit off? I hate that, and so does everybody else. We should never... 
Windows, cut it out. We should never get a higher level item that's lower, significantly lower in this case, than a lower level item. Okay, well, it's not an upgrade, ladies and gentlemen. It's worse in the two, the two ways that count the most, damage and velocity. Unfrickin' believable. Okay, we're sticking with this one. See, the thing about that, too, is in Alpha 18 and 19, I think, or at least in 19, they fixed that, so that wasn't the case, but now it is again. Who makes these stupid-ass decisions, man? I'm just saying. Ugh. Okay, put your wine in. Let's get, let's get moving. Let's get moving. Keep it moving, man. Ammo display case. Okay, useful, useful stuff. Yeah. Okay. More shotgun shells at Shotgun Messiah. All right. I think we're finished in here. I did hit all of these racks, right? I think, I think so. Let's just double check. Yeah. Uh, all right. So we need to go that way to get our satchel. So let's see. We came through here, right? Yeah. Came through here. And now uh, I guess we go this way. Close encounters. Uh, there's a light right there, so looks like that's the direction it wants us to go. That's the fat loots right there. Why do I get the feeling like we're going to get a serious rush when we... Go over there. Like, seriously. Um. Alright, let's get little friend ready. We, we can just walk up to the fat loots and take it? Like, no. <laughs> I don't believe it. Uh, something's going to happen here, you guys. I, I have not done this POI, and I don't think I've seen anybody else do it either. Something's going to happen here. You know it is. <clears throat> Ooh. Look at that. All right, where's our explosives? Let's give them a, a triple. Oh, lordy. Go down. Go down. Go down. Go down and stay down. You too. I didn't say you could stand back up. Okay, let's reload. Oh, that was a great time to reload. Hurry up. All right, here, we better move and medicate. Move and medicate, move and medicate. Let's get our back to the corner here. Okay, reload while we got the opportunity. Man, we are messed up. Broken arm, broken leg. Well, actually, it's sprained. Infectinated and abrasionated. Darling. I know you're not dead. Now you are. Okay, uh, we still have a pretty decent number of red dots. This is quite the reinforced door. So there's one Zeke in there. I knew something like that was going to happen. I mean, this is seven days to die. 
right? It's like there's no way I can just walk out there and get the fat loots without something happening. That door's locked. Okay, well, let's let's help this guy out. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Put that down there. Okay, that was exciting. Got a red dot over here. Pretty much just woke the whole place up in one fell swoop. Okay, we got a red dot over here. We're probably supposed to go... Now, wait a minute. Have I done this place before? I don't remember it now, to be honest with you guys. There's something about it that seems kind of familiar now. Maybe I have. I don't know. I, I don't remember. Not sure. Anyway. So this is like a freaking um, training range place. That's what this is. Well, let's go get the fat loots. Does this just open up to the outside or another part of the compound? Yeah, I know you're hurt. It shows that it's like right in here. Oh, wow. Weird, man. Okay. Okay, we got that done. Now we just have to kill all the rest of the red dots. Or yellow dots, in this case. Um, I don't remember if I... Remember if I put any... Meds in... My bike or not. Well, let's just go this way. Seems to me like I remember coming in here and climbing up here and getting rushed up here and a long time ago. I just, I don't remember exactly when that happened, but I believe that did happen. Um, all right, we can't see anybody from here for sneaky sneaks. So what I'm going to do is shoot you. He was just a little out of range for shotgun, but it's okay. All right. Can we uh, do something like this so we don't take quite as much damage falling down? Oh, well, so much for that. <laughs> I was going to put another one down. Let's see if I have any meds in my motorcycle here. Oh, I do. Good for me. Okay, so I guess we can't do anything about the sprains, but uh, we can take this for the infection... And we can take this to half the m amount of time on the other criticals. And get a little bit of health back. And since we're here, we should drop some stuff off. So let me do that really quick. Alright, let's resume. Um, so we came through here originally. And let's go back out this way. So we still got some baddies over here in this shooting range area. Along with some ammo. Uh, yeah, that's a lot of baddies. Okay, here we go again. Slow down, Arlene. Oh, shit. That was... I thought you were dead. Return to the trader. Okay, we are done. Whew. Yeah, I want to say that I... Uh, I think I just kind of popped in here on a whim a long time ago. I don't even remember exactly when that was. It might not even have been Alpha 20 now I think about it. 
And I go, oh, this place is interesting. And then I got rushed by a whole crap ton of Zeekers. And yeah, almost what was almost killed. And I think that's how everything went down. All right. Yeah, I know your leg hurts, but I don't got time for you to be a wuss. <laughs> okay. So that's the fat loots, obviously. Well, here, let's, let's do the fat loots first. Nice little supply of ammunition there. Okay. All right. A little more ammo. Mo power box. What's that? Oh, yeah, we really should do a drone, too. Just, just mess with it a little bit. Okay, let's open this chest here. Five hundred million lockpicks later. Jeez. Um, do we already have all of those? I don't know. Maybe we don't. Uh, there's some yellow leg armor. Is that better than what we're wearing now? No. Nah, well, it, who knows? Maybe it is. No, it's not. Okay. Does everything have a triple? You have a triple. You have a triple. You only have a double. And you only have double. Okay, so modify this. We're down to one slot, you guys. One slot left. It's a beautiful thing. Okay. Um, let's go check this truck. See what's in here. Good stuff. Um, there might be something at the top of this tower. No, there isn't. Okay. I'm sure there's probably more loot in this place, too, but I think we got the lion's share of it anyway. Did we go in here? I don't think we did. This is where all the Zeeks uh, jumped out. It just goes back that way. Yeah, this is kind of cool, though. A little training area. Yeah, nothing up there. Okay. Didn't we... We just went up there anyways, didn't we? I think we did, yeah. All right, you guys. Well, I will uh, meet you back at the trader. We'll do our turning. All right, let's see what Rectum's got for us. You think you're pretty smart now. Pump shotgun. You? Here's your pay. Um, Stein. that's five forty-five. Yeah, let's take the pump. It's worth more. It might be better than ours, but it, it looks like it isn't. Uh, so we will take it, and because it's blue, we will put some mods on it and resell it to them and make a bundle of money. All right, next job. You've got a fetch and clear, another fetch and clear. You got some knights and another fetch and clear. All right, uh, what's what's this one? School. All right, I don't think we've done a school yet, have we? I wonder if that's the um, just the normal. Now this game, high school place. Let's take those. Don't want the rest of those. All right, you guys. Um, so let's see where are we at. We're getting close here on our time. Let's go back to the base before I let you go. And it seems to me like I found the drone schematic on a live stream that I did a while back. I don't remember for sure. Let's go see if we can actually do that and what it takes because I've been meaning to mess around with the drone too. Um, so that, that's actually another goal we have in this series. And I just want to see if I can make it. And if I can, then what we'll do is we'll maybe the next episode we'll go uh, take our, take the drone out and ch check it out and see what that's all about. Plus, again, like I said, we've got the uh, one more house flipper to get the outside of the house done. Uh, so that's on the list. We got another Horde Knight and a tier five or three or however many to do. Tier fives are tough to do though uh, on a let's play just because they take so long, but. We'll, we'll figure out a way to make it work, so. Got a lot of stuff to put away here, too, don't I? My goodness, okay. Uh, well, let's grab all of that. 
and uh, did I grab the no okay whoop I'm just gonna um, drop everything in here for now except for stuff we need to keep with us which is this and this That's all of our normal inventory there. Okay, let's go over here and robotic drone. Okay, I can make a robotic drone. Very cool. All right, so next episode, guys, we're going to make ourselves a drone. It's only going to be a level one, but because I don't, uh, do I have any points, by the way? We have no points. Okay. We'll make this drone and we'll just check it out and see what it's all about. I, I have the plating mod and I've got the medic mod unlocked. So, robotic drone cargo mod. I can see how that would be super useful. What does this do? Morale booster mod schematic? I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what that does. I don't see this being useful at all because, you know, we have our own headlamp. Unless you happen to have a drone in the very early game before you found a headlamp. I don't know. Uh, but definitely see the use in, in these first three. Don't know what that does, so we'll figure that out if we ever unlock it, or you guys can tell me in the comments. And we'll, yeah, we'll play around with the drone in the next episode. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share with the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.